Welcome second grade families. My name is Mrs. Sibilia and I'm the director of religious ed at St. Aloysius. This is our welcome video to let you know about this year's religious ed program for second grade. You will be getting the FOM Gospel Weeklies to work with your students at home. As a family, it should take you no longer than 45 minutes to read through them and do the activities. I will also send a questionnaire home on a weekly basis that you can fill out electronically and submit back to me regarding your readings. The Flam Gospel Weeklies have the gospel stories in them. So when you're attending mass in person or watching it online, you're going to hear that same gospel and the homily will relate to it. So it will just reinforce what your student has learned at home. In addition, for second graders, we're asking that you are come to church once a month where I will give you those designated dates in advance and we will be breaking you out into groups to attend. One parent or guardian must attend with the student. At this time, we will be giving them their first reconciliation and their first Holy Communion instructions. So you won't have to do that part at home. Um, we will take care of that for you in person. However, if our current guidelines from the state or the diocese change and we're not allowed to meet in person for this, then we will make an adjustment and we will do a virtual or a video recording of the lesson so that you can review it at home with your children. So I encourage you to um, continue to watch our weekly masses, to, to continue praying with your children at home I will send an email out in the next couple of weeks regarding picking up your materials, which will be given to you via a drive-by the front of the church, and I will hand the materials to you through your car, so we will make sure we keep our social distancing. And all of the key dates will be in your packet, so you'll know in advance what date you will attend. You will, there will also be the date for when First Reconciliation will happen and when we plan on holding First Communions. Pending, no additional changes with the government guidelines. So I welcome you back this year and I look forward to guiding your children through these sacraments. And if you have any questions at all, please do not hesitate to call me or email me at any time. Thank you.